Am I the asshole? For refusing to let my wife name our kids something stupid? Me and my wife are having our first child together. She is currently nine months pregnant and could give birth any time in the next couple of weeks. The only major fight we have had throughout her pregnancy happened a couple days ago, and it was about what we were going to name our kid. It all started when we found out the gender of the baby. We didn't do a gender reveal and decided to find out the gender at one of her checkups because we didn't want to spend time making two lists of names then have to get rid of one after. So after we found out we were having a boy we sat down together and made a list. Almost all of the names she suggested were normal, until the one that caused me to write this post. She suggested we name our son Moon. She told me the name was from this movie she watched when she was younger and that it always stuck with her. I told her the name was a little out there and he would get made fun of for it. She claimed he wouldn't and we started going back and forth trying to decide whether to add the name to the list or not. Eventually she agreed to keep the name off the list, we picked some that we liked, and I thought that was that. Later on in her pregnancy her mom decided to throw a baby shower as it was her first grandchild, and my wife's pregnancy was almost over and we hadn't celebrated once. It was fine for the most part until we started to open the gifts. Most of them were normal baby things like diapers and bottles, until we got to her mom's gift. My wife opened the gift bag and pulled out a blue handmade blanket. It seemed normal enough at first until my wife unfolded it and lo and behold there was the name Moon written on the blanket. When I saw it I was pissed but didn't want to cause a scene so I stayed quiet. After that reveal I had family members come up to me and ask me about the name and why I hadn't told them. I didn't know what to tell them as I didn't have a clue about this either and just had to embarrassingly tell my family that, which pissed me off even more. Once the event ended and me and my wife went home I started to question her about the name. She got defensive and told me that it was a good name and that I was overreacting about it. I brought up the earlier points and told her it was a stupid name for a kid and if she wanted to name something Moon so bad she could use the name for a dog. She got upset and called her mom to come get her. After she left she called me and told me she wouldn't be coming back for a while. Everyone I've talked to about this has said I'm not the asshole, but now that my wife has been gone and I've been thinking about it I feel like I could have handled the situation better. I tut. Not the asshole because it's a two yes decision. That being said, has your wife done any research on this name? Mune means breasts in Japanese. Does she even like your kid? Not the asshole I think that your wife is being pretty ridiculous about the name. That's an awful name and you're right that the kid will be bullied for this. Your wife is incredibly wrong for deciding to name the child that name anyway, regardless of what you think. It's just as much your child as it is hers. Mune Guardian of the Moon 2014 Mune, a young fawn, is chosen as the new Guardian of the Moon. From IMDB please don't name your child this. Not the asshole not the asshole not the asshole. Not the asshole. Both parents have to agree to the name. It doesn't matter if it's boring, weird or ridiculous, both have to agree. Not the asshole. You guys are allowed to downvote me but I think that naming your children after fictional characters is not a good idea. I know your wife liked that French animated movie but she should consider that naming a baby is not the same as naming a pet. Not the asshole. Your wife needs to learn to compromise and communicate like an adult. This is one of those two yeses one no situations. You did not have two yeses, but your wife proceeded as though you did, even going behind your back to do so. Maybe it's her pregnancy hormones, but she's very much in the wrong here. Your kid is going to end up being called Moon Moon or something along those lines by his classmates. Kids are mean enough as it is. No need to give them ammo. Not the asshole. Not the asshole. It's your kid too. And Mun is an incredibly stupid name. Not the asshole she agreed to the name not being a choice, then snuck around with her mother in a weird power display to attempt to strong arm you. 
more than worried about the name, I would be worried that your wife is deceitful and manipulative. Not the asshole. When my wife and I were picking names, we agreed that a unique name was okay, as long as it would be something the kid wouldn't have to constantly spell. Moon would be constantly spelled moon. Unless you pronounce it differently, then it would be money. Not the asshole. Not the asshole. I don't know how you'd pronounce it moon or moony. Either way, as a teacher, I'd say please pick something else for your kid's sake. Not the asshole, but your wife sure is. In this instance, it doesn't even matter what the actual name is. But you guys discussed it, didn't agree, and then she went behind your back, made up her mind, and then told other people her decision while completely dismissing you. That's the real issue here. It needs to be addressed now, because you just got a preview of what her parenting style will be in the future. Seriously, she is going to name your kid after Moon Guardian of the Moon? It wasn't even that great of a movie. But seriously, you have more problems than the name. Like your wife trying to hide the name from you. I'm guessing she didn't think you would find out until after it was on the birth certificate and couldn't be changed. I don't know how you could trust her after going behind your back in general about something as big as your child's name. Not the asshole and quite frankly, it's a dumb name. Picture that nonsense on a resume. Mune Johnson, Project Manager. Just no. It actually sounds like your wife conspired with her mom to make the blanket, as if once opened and seen, the name of your son would be Fetacompli. I'm concerned about your wife's manipulative and secretive behavior as well as her reluctance to tell you the truth. If I were in your situation, I'd seek out couples counseling. Based on how she chose to behave in the past, I'm not sure that you talking to her directly would be effective. I can imagine her being defensive while justifying her choices. I could be wrong, though. Not the asshole, BTW. Both parents need to agree on their child's name. My knee-jerk reaction is that I hate this name too is it like Sand Dune but with an M? Naming a baby isn't a unilateral decision, she shouldn't just choose it without you. Naming a baby isn't like naming a cat you have to really think it through carefully so they aren't stuck with something that sounds cute when they're 4 but ridiculous at 34. She's not thinking long term emo. And if you don't like the name, you have the right to veto it. I would die hard on this hill, it's going to affect your kid forever. Not the asshole. Up, make sure you make up and go to the hospital with your wife because if not, the birth certificate is going to read Munop. Natar. Naming a child together should be too yes. What if you told your family your son would be named insert name of your choice and they gave handmade gifts with that name on? Would she appreciate that? No? Then why should you? When I was younger, I also watched a movie and wanted to name my kids either Corb and Dallas for a boy or Lilu Dakota as a girl. Thank goodness I didn't get pregnant when I was 13. Naming your child is a one no, two yes situation. Not the asshole. It's slang for vagina in Greek. Not the asshole. Show her your post and all the comments.